Yo, what's going on guys? So I done had a couple drinks in me and I'm on one tonight. So I'm about to ruffle some feathers tonight. You can unsub, you can hit the dislike button a hundred thousand times. I don't give a fuck. Cause y'all need to hear this shit. I told y'all when I got on YouTube that I was gonna be real, raw, and honest with y'all. All right, so that's what I'm about to do. So you wanna know why women don't take you serious. The reason why women and these girls you talk to don't take you serious is because you don't take you serious, all right? There was a time that I didn't either, but I fixed that shit. See, most of you guys, you fucking sorry excuses for men. You sit around and you're jacking off all the time. You watching porn. You fat as fuck. Feeling sorry for yourself crying and shit. Oh, they only like bad boys and these type of women. Oh my God, they only like the thug guy. Shut the fuck up, bitch. Yo, little bitch ass over there fucking crying about female nature and how women are, how women don't fucking want you, and how the world is this towards men. You ain't got no motherfucking goals. You ain't got no plans. You got no drive. But you want a woman to respect you and support you. You supposed to be a leader. That's what a man's supposed to be, a motherfucking leader. Where are you going to lead her to, bro? Where are you going to lead her to? To her death? To your death, to the motherfucking clogged arteries with your little fat ass sitting on the couch all the time, fucking playing video games, eating chips and shit, your fucking lazy ass. Oh, you, never mind, hold on. You're going to lead her to your mama basement, right? That's where you're going to lead her to. All right? Like, what type of shit is that? I had, listen, this is what prompted all this shit. I had a guy email me talking about telling me he struggles with women because he's a big guy and asked me what to do to improve his mouthpiece because I teach game and all this shit. I asked him his height and weight, of course. I asked him his height and weight. He gonna say five foot eight, almost 300 motherfucking pounds. Fuck the mouthpiece. It ain't no fucking how to improve your mouthpiece. Get your fat big ass into the gym. Talking about some, oh, I'm a big guy. Motherfucker, you ain't no big guy. Tra Travis Kelsey, let me explain something to y'all. Travis Kelsey is a big guy. See, we need to stop all these fucking terms and sugarcoating shit. Travis Kelsey is a big guy. All right? Mike Tyson is a big guy. LeBron James is a big guy. You, you fucking fat, nigga. You fat. You a fat, sloppy Joe built, triple pancake stack. Rick Ross, DJ Khaled built looking motherfucker. That's what you is. You fat. Nick gonna ask me uh, how to improve his, his mouthpiece. Bitch, get in the fucking gym. Talking about some, I'm a big guy. That's, this is why women don't take you fucking serious. Because you don't take yourself serious. Talking about I'm a big guy. Bitch, you fat. You ain't, you ain't no motherfucking big guy. This, this is the shit that I'm getting right now. This is the shit that I'm, this is the fucking emails that I'm getting. This is why women don't take you serious. You want to know another reason women don't fucking take you serious? Because you sending LOLs and laughing faces after every fucking message. Yeah, you want to send fucking ha ha's and hee he's after every fucking message. Like some shit funny. Every time you talk to a girl, your little fucking goofy ass is over there talking about hip, hip, hip. What the fuck is funny, nigga? Bitch ass nigga ain't nothing funny. Fuck ass nigga. Goofy ass nigga. Stop trying to be motherfucking goof man. And like I told you, I used to do this shit too. I used to do this shit too. I used to do all this shit. But I fucking wake up and I fucking smell the coffee. I fucking figured this shit out. They don't take you serious because you don't take you serious. Nigga over there, you ain't got no motherfucking plans, do you? You ain't got no motherfucking goals. You ain't figured out shit. You over there watching fucking Fortnite jacking off every day to big booty bitches. But then you want a big booty girl. You ain't gonna get no motherfucking big booty girl over there jacking off all the time. So I'm trying to get y'all to fucking see. Fuck wrong with y'all. Talking about why women don't take me serious. Oh, women only want this type of guy, and women they just don't want a nice guy. You ain't no motherfucking nice guy. You's a fucking weak man. Accept that shit and wake the fuck up. Man. Oh, bitch ass nigga. You lucky I got my motherfucking laundry almost done, or I keep going in, put my fucking foot up your ass, keep fucking going. And this is what I'm telling y'all right here. 2024, bro. I'm telling y'all. We done with the shit. Get your fucking shit together. Start working. Get, get a fucking passion. Start a business. Go to work. Get a job. Get an education. Work on your shit. Get some more fucking money. If you think that's what you need, get some more motherfucking money. Improve your fucking game, your social skills. 
Get your fat ass in the fucking gym, you sloppy Joe built bitch. You jiggly body, flabby fly motherfucker. Get your fucking fat ass in the gym. That's what you need to do. Like, comment, subscribe. This shit short as fuck. But I'm sick of this shit. I don't want to hear this shit no more. No more fucking complaining, bitching about how women are. No more motherfucking sending me trying to find cheat codes and shortcuts. Ain't no fucking shortcuts, nigga. What you think this shit is? Five, eight, almost 300 pounds. Listen, my nigga, I'm not trying to down you. I'm just keeping it real with you, nigga. Get your fucking fat ass in the gym. Talking about you's a big guy. Nigga ain't no motherfucking big guy. Like, comment, subscribe. I, you know what? To be honest, I don't give a fuck if you subscribe, nigga. Dislike the video over and over and over again. I don't give a fuck. I'm just keeping it real and raw with you niggas. You need to improve. All my guys need to improve. And for my guys that's been rocking with me, you're going to laugh at this shit. But for you that's hearing this for the first time, it's the real truth. I'll see y'all next time. Peace.